on tonight's Whatever Happened to the Target Dog. Hi everyone, it's me Riggs, the Target Dog. Well, the ex-Target Dog. He went from showing us the bullseyes on great deals to drinking and partying with the groupies. You're not showing any of those paparazzi photos, are you? This behavior and excessive over-treating led to obesity and the demise of his career. He relocated to Nelson, B.C. after his fallout, and we got an exclusive look into his rehab, recovery, and rediscovering life after fame. I was sick of the city life. I would have moved eventually. And all this is my domain. Everything the light touches is my kingdom. Well, until that fence, anyways. They're really strict about us eating healthy, but I handle it well. I've taken up lots of activities like chasing balls, running upstairs, running through bushes, running down paths, as well as fishing, digging, bird watching, and boating, and long walks on the beach. I mean, look at this view, the lake, look at these leaves, keeps you calm and tranquil. Hey, is that a stick? Give me the stick, 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 give me the stick. And I've become an excellent swimmer too. Just keep swimming, swimming, just keep swimming, swimming, just keep swimming. Oh, I have a cramp, I have a cramp, cramp. I've made lots of friends here and still see lots of my fans and everyone's really nice to me. And hey, hey, give me back my stick. Hey, give it back. My really good buddy is Oliver. We met when he was dropped off for treatment too. He came here to become a vegetarian. He had to learn how to resist meat and I helped him out with that. Cause you know, nobody's perfect. Speaking of perfect, you were seen canoodling with the Meow Mix cat, and she had kittens. I'm not going to comment on that. Well, he never admit it now, but we had a thing, and he just hit me right in the heart with that bullseye. But now we, well, I can't talk about this. I have to go. As you can see, there's more to life than being a spokesdog, and I found it. <sighs> can I sleep now? Thanks for watching. Tune in next week for the first ever interview with the House Hippo.